for wild card one. Nashville won 5 1 in Chicago last night, got back late. Here's the Zaxby's opening puck drop, and Michael McCarron wins the faceoff back to Roman Yossi. Here we go. Jet Greaves. He knows what it takes, he knows how to pay the price. And if you want to score in the playoffs, that's the area that you have to get to, and he's a pro at that. Right off the draw, score! Opening goal scored by the Blue Jackets right off the faceoff. James Malatesta found himself wide open between the circles and a shocking 1 0 lead for Columbus. Right off the faceoff, faceoff win here. He comes off the right wing and cuts right to the middle. He finds daylight in the middle of the ice there, gets in the slot, and he goes against the grain. Saros went down a little early and he was late to bring that left arm, his glove hand arm down. And Matesta just went right under the arm. Ivan Provorov, but the veteran held him off. Roman Yossi tries to reorganize the attack. Evangelista comes in all the way. Backdoor score! The Predators answer back. It's Tommy Novak. Points in three straight on a beautiful feed from Evangelista. Luke Evangelista may be playing his best hockey of the season right now. And look at how he sets up this play. His head is down. He's not looking at Tommy Novak. He knows where Tommy Novak is, and he's going to get on the puck. He puts it right on the tape. In the role that he's in. Interior pass. Sent in. Alex Texier's shot. And another save for Soros. On Cody Glass, a great chance and a good save there by Greaves. First power play of the night for the Predators. Going to work at Nyquist. Yossi scores! Nashville wasting no time. A power play goal from the captain. Now Yossi goes to work. McDonough backing him up. Novak with speed, leaves it for Anthony Beauvillier. Novak, Isonet scores! Tommy Novak, that's two in the first period. And the Predators lead by two. Often referred to as the Novakian here on the broadcast. And watch what he does here. This is just... A beautiful pass here by Beauvillier. He just pulls it in. You think as a goalie, he's going high. He's going up top. You have time. You're going to rip that thing. And Novak's going. He wants to beat Greaves down on the ice. It's tough. It's a tough balance. I don't think you want to go through that full rebound, uh, rebuild because it, it could be miserable. Oh, boy. Olivier with a hard hit. Sherwood answers back. Anderson Dolan went down hard. And Shen. Shen is going to go after Olivier. These are two heavyweights. Watch out. Shen with the left hands, uppercuts, Shen again. The Biloxi Bull coming back with the right hand. He'll try it for the uppercut. These are two tough hombres right here. Shen pounding away with the left. The helmet's off, and they'll break it off. Right here, Anderson Dolan from the side, suspect hit, whatever you want to call it. And here comes Luke Shen. you got to deal with the sheriff. <laughs> Excitement in Smashville. Now Goudreau, this is where he likes to operate. Here he comes. Does a full U-turn and now brings it back in. He's like a water buck. Moronkov. Centered it off target. Twisting back. A great save by Soros. Oh, what a stop that was. And then a great goal by Goudreau. An impossible angle. Right at the buzzer. Now did it count? It was right as... Right there, there's the second one. It goes right to Gaudreau. And I'm pretty sure this goes in the net before the time expires. We'll see right here. The calls the calls oh, it doesn't. The under review. It doesn't even go in. It didn't go in. It doesn't go in. It goes off of the post with .1 seconds on the clock. That is not even a goal. After review, the puck does not cross the goal line. Therefore, we have no goal. Johnny Hockey got to get his eyes checked. Come on, bud. <laughs> Johnny Hockey. No goal. Done. He goes inside. He pays the price. The factor owns the paint. In fact, that goal against the Jets was the second furthest shot that he has scored on all year. And it was an enormous goal. Carrier waits for his teammates to tag. Zucker. 
trying to work for body position. Mark Jankowski, Cody Glass with him. Fed over, pounded by Carrier, tip they score! The Predators go in on the four check, and Alex Carrier lets it fly. It's 4-1. And this is what you want to see in this game. The last home regular season game, the Predators don't stop. Keep working on your game. Look at Cody Glass. He wants to get back in there. He's got something to prove. He's given other guys rest. He goes to the net. This goal goes in the net. Save Greaves. Follow up Yossi. Tipped by Beauvillier. Sent up the seam. Breakaway. Texier. Texier in. He scores! Great counterattack by the Blue Jackets. The Predators had a good look. And then a beautiful pass finished by Texier to make it 4 2. Yeah. If you continue to play the same way, it's tough. This puck gets turned over. Texier's got that jump. A little hesitation there from the D man. And then right there, I think Saros thought he was going to try to go over the glove. Watch him pulls it in a little bit. And he looks like he's he might have he might have been trying to go over the pad under the glove and missed his shot because you know Columbus is it you want to get through this game you got a, out to a 4-1 lead but give and go Yossi finds O'Reilly moves inside out continues to probe one touch pass Nyquist sent right in front off the skate of Forsberg and in it's gonna count. Forsberg let the left skate go dead and let the puck bank off him. A brilliant play. Huge soccer fan and player. The refs are huddling up. Let's see, does he kick this? No kicking motion. He turns his skate, which you're allowed to do. Look at the patience of Yossi. You can turn, deflect, guide that puck into the net. There is no forward kicking motion. This will be a goal. And look at the puck movement there. And that's just... Again, Philip Forsberg's thought process, how quick he is. His stick is getting tied up. That puck is not on the tape. He turns his skate. Novak with speed. Evangelista shuffles his way. Hits the open man. Yossi advances all the way. Here he scores! Yes, sir! It's a four-point night for the captain. Well, have a night, Yossi. Have a night, captain. And look at this. This is Bobby Orr-esque. As he goes across, cuts in. Look at that. There's no room here. That little pump fake there. He got the stick check. There's no space there. He gets it past Greaves' stick, who's trying to poke check the defenseman, and tucks it in right around Greaves' right skate. Not only did he create the screen, he got the goal. He went to that the hard area, and quite honestly, he's making a he's making a case for himself right now. And that's exactly what, as a player, you want to do with that opportunity. And it leaks past Stastny on the rush. Here they come. Stand forth. Great pass. Score. Oh, a great play by the Blue Jackets with that spin back and too much speed. Trey Fix Wolanski tucked it in. We'll check for an offside here. There's a potential. But regardless, Fix Wolinski. It's a great name, by the way. But you can see the Blue Jackets here. And watch the, the pass here. This is, uh, he goes right to that. We'll see if this is offside or not. It could be. But there's just a backhand pass. And Fix Wolinski, give and go. He goes right to the net. Danforth with the spinning. This is set up, too. He creates that angle. And that's a really good stick. Oh, we're not going to challenge it, but... 40 seconds left. And while we got a second, another quick thanks to the fans from up top here. I know we're going to be talking about it a lot. Into the high slot, another shot, score! Columbus is going to sprint all the way to the finish line, and it's another one for Fix Wolanski. What a night he's had. Again, the, the Preds, they, they're just trying to get to the finish line. You know, again, detail, structure, yeah, they're there, but they're not. They're talk about time and space every time this is the final goodbye before the playoffs begin two seconds to go Lazar touches up and that's it